Whoa. 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 It's minifigure illusion reporting from somewhere on space ship. Brick shipper. Hey, how's it going out there? Well, it, it, it's come time to uh, finish up the International Space Station. I always like these, the idea boxes. Lego makes such better boxes for the idea sets. It's been a long time coming, finish the, finishing this thing up, hasn't it? So as uh, if you last recall, we had skipped from number bag four to number bag six because I was going to do number bag five with Owl, but we've moved on. So I have all the, the panels. Panels are done. EX8512. Yeah, it's been a long time coming. I've been... Uh, I'm backlogged here. I've got a, I got some reviews to do. I'm, I'm going to get my Lego schedule going here. I'm just, I finally finished organizing the studio. I think today. I think today I finally finished organizing it. So we're going to start getting in there on the summer schedule and uh, doing that. So... We're here with the number bag five. Let's see what we got going on. We have the space station essentially the core of the body built right here. We have its uh, all its little additions on the side. I think everything's here. We got the soda pop top. We got, I, we got the little shuttle. I like, this is my favorite part is the little shuttle so far. I want to make some more of those, man. And then uh, we got everything else there. We're right at, we're right at rock and roll. Everything looks tight and it's ready. So we're going to, we're going to get in there. We got the panels. So um, the expert builder. Yeah, we're doing some late night leg going. It's uh you know, you know how we do it this Lego thing. It's basically to escape the larger world at hand. All right, we got let's let's set up our let's set up our little 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 scene here and uh get it going. There we got that right there. I put the little spaceman in there right there. We got the shuttle. I'm going to put the shuttle in the foreground. I like the shuttle. And we got the microphone, ready to rock and roll. We'll put minifigure illusion. Uh, if he doesn't, we need to get him a better pedestal. Then we got the bag of, these are the spare parts. The extras, extra, extra, read all about. This is some extra satellite. I don't quite know what it's about. We've got our... We've got all of our solar panels right there. We'll put those right there. Let's do it. Let's do it to it, dude. Oh, I got to get to where I'm at. Where am I at? Number bag five. Whoa, Chihuahua. Whoa, Chihuahua. All right, all right. Here we go. Oh, this doesn't look like it's tight. Tighten that up. All right, number bag five. Here it is. All right, we got enough room going on here. Let's do it. Let's do it, EX3512. And mm. 
All right. Let's get the parts dumped out. Let's get in the zone. Let's do it to it. Free as a bird. Oh, we got a free as a bird out there. Nice, dude. I like your handle. Free as a bird. Right off the bat, look at this this part. Did we already get one of these out there? I'll, I'll bring this in for the you know, that like part with the the metallic print on it. It's a nice part. It's like a super big soda pop can. We got some more silver discs. We got some white panels. Look, we got some some stuff. All right, man. I'm gonna do two of these. Some little roof pieces. So yeah, man. It's uh, it's been just trying to chill into the zone, if you know what I mean. Just click it, trying to click back in the zone. It's officially summertime here. I feel like we. We've made it this far, man. We made it this far. I'm worried we gotta do two of the two of these. So I'm just doing two two at a time, time, two, two at a time. Yeah, I've been wanting to do this for a for a, a couple days now. Probably like a week almost. But I just get kind of, it's kind of late at night, and I'm like, ah, you know what, like, I'm only half into, like, doing it, but I kind of want to do it, and then I'm like, I don't really want to finish it up, because then I won't have anything to do, and then I realized I have two, two Star Wars sets I've been just sitting, sitting on for a while, I got an, a Kylo Ren's shuttle like the older one. And I also have Poe's black and orange fighter that I got from a, uh, one of those bricks and things stores. I, I, I did a purchase there. Like, man, like almost a year ago, it's just been sitting around for like a year. So I got that, that on standby. All right. Look at how that kind of comes together. I'm, uh, I'm making it International Space Station, dude, for Kanye and Elon to go hang out in, man, right? Oh, where's the piece? I need another piece. I can't, I can't find it, dude. I, uh, I saw that I saw that there's like that mechanical the Harry Potter's got that owl coming out. That thing looks pretty badass, dude. I was just checking that out on the uh on the Lego website. The Harry Potter, whatever the owl's called. That is uh that's the real deal. This literally is the brick ship. I'm gonna paint the town brown on this one. Mm, where's all the pieces there it is so i saw the harry potter owl i'm pretty fired up on that there's a couple new star wars sets that are coming out that look pretty pretty rad i have to say i'm looking forward to getting that uh whatever that shuttle is here the razor the razor shuttle you know I'm 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 believing in in Lego. Lego's my way through this whole thing. I'm I'm pretty stoked to get the the studio finally organized. It took forever to sort out all the loose parts. Like one of those things. I it just felt like I was doing it for for weeks. But I finally reorganized everything. I got everything into the its proper bin, its proper placement. Why are the Lego ideas build so much more satisfying after you build them? The Lego idea sets are the best, my favorite stuff in Lego. I, I have to admit, 
the Lego ideas are where it's at. I want to get that out. There's another. I don't know. I'm I'm in agreement. The ideas, the ideas stuff is is per, you know why it is. You know, I think this is why the Lego idea stuff is so much more like right on is because it's built by other like the imagination of other Lego people. You know what I mean? Like the Lego idea stats, like stuff that isn't like built by Lego engineers. It's built by like Lego people who then the engineers go make it. So I think it's closer to like us, if that makes any sense. You know what I mean? I think it's like more organic and more like less fan. Like I, you know, which one I, I look back, I really wish I could have gotten that like fishing pier one, the fishing pier idea one's awesome, dude. But yeah, I'm a big fan of the ideas. I think that's my overall favorite series so far. You know, I, I'm a big fan of the Star Wars stuff, but that's just Star Wars stuff. I mean, for the general variety, I mean, I'm looking at the idea set. I got the Friends. It's all a lot of space, the space thing. It's all a lot of space stuff. I got the Flint. I like the Flintstones house, too. I have to admit, I'm a, I'm a full fan of the Flintstones house. <laughs> All right. Oh, well, I got to build some like contraption here. I better focus here, people. Yeah, so that's my take on the, the Lego idea stuff. I just think it's more down to earth as I build a space station it's more it's more relatable it's actually functioning stuff I think that isn't that like the VW bug that that person sent me a Legos idea too all right what do we got hey every time I need a part replaced on my vehicle I think of how of how I wish I could just order the part on a website and snap it in like a, like a Lego. Yeah. I hear you on that. The, the classic Lego flower shop. I like, do like the modular sh stuff. Uh, the, is that like the classic Lego flower shop? Is that a modular one? I like the modulars too. I, I'd say though, my favorite build so far has been the ninjago city port thing docks like for like the real like depth of building it like that that's been my that's been my jam i really did like the uh, ninjago stuff like i hope they add more modulars to the ninjago thing that's my that's my that's my real hope is they add some more stuff to the ninjago reality Cause that stuff's that that's a tight that's one of my faves. I mean, look at that thing back there, dude. That thing, that thing's badass, dude. Right there. That's for all the marbles. That thing, but that's two different sets added together. And the backside, the detail on that thing is so rad. I have to say, the detail. I love the Lego Creator, but that's my favorite set but that's two sets it's just so clean when you go look at it the detail in the thing with all the little like studios and coffee shops and all that kind of stuff i'm a fan i like i i'm not that crazy about the whole ninjago ninjagua thing as al says al calls it ninjagua but I, i'll give it to you that ninjagua city's the cat's meow Literally, real, real. So I think if I, I don't know, like if if I could only take one set with me into the future, what would it be? I would be that giant Millennium Falcon. 
I, I, I say that I like the Ninjago city the best, but I have, I think if I had that giant millennium Falcon, that one would pretty much, that's the one I, I that's the one I wish someone would send me the, the real millennium Falcon, dude, just the big dog, just that giant, what's that thing? Like 7,000 billion pieces. I know it's $800, dude. How crazy is that? An $800 Lego set, dude. That's next level, dude. I've seen it though. I've looked at one in the store that's built on the display. It's pretty fantastic. It is a it is a fantastic Lego creation. They they really did just outdo themselves on that one. All right, boom! This is some sort of that's that fantastic piece right there. All right, we got some sort of like. Bar. Those are some sort of something, something routers. I don't know what any of this stuff is. I should actually like do a little research and find out what all these components are on the old space shuttle, the International Space Station, I should say. I should at least get it the name right. The International. The ISS, the International Space Station, bro. Brosif. All right. There we go. There we go. Okay, what's this? Oh, oh. It's got a, an, an undercarriage here with the... If, if I'm guessing what the extra parts are going to be from this, it's going to be some of these white tiles and in round and square and a little a little crab hand. I think those are going to be the extras, the crab hand. There's a USS Enterprise set, like like the, the aircraft carrier or the, the Star Wars thing. I mean, the Star Trek thing. I guess it wouldn't be an aircraft carrier because they don't do military, but. All right, where does this thing go? Is it like underneath here somewhere? Where does that go? It looks like it wants to connect to something orange, dude. I don't have anything orange in there. Oh, there is, there is over there. Okay, I get it. All right. Okay. The Enterprise, like the aircraft carrier. Wow, that's got to be crazy, dude. Sonny Michael. The aircraft carrier. Holy smoke! I mean, I'm the. I won't. I've gone, dude. After I went to that Lego show and saw what people could build, uh, my mind was pretty much blown. At this point, like, my mind is pretty much blown. And I've watched one of those, like, Lego, like, where they get the pile of bricks, the, the TV show, the master creator, whatever it is. Dude, that one with that dude built with the, they built that wave with the Neptune's hand coming out of it, and what people can build with Lego blows my mind. I, 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 I really just, it freaks me out on a whole level of just like, what? Like, what? They built what without a Legos? Again, I think one of my favorite aspects of the Lego world is you can build anything. There's nothing that can't be built out of Legos. Except for a brighter future. Hmm. I sure, I sure hope Lego can. We can build a brighter future with Lego, man. Jiminy Crickets. I feel we can build a brighter future out of Lego. Okay, boy, we got all sorts of stuff going on here. Lots of satellites. Beep beep beep. Where are the aliens? Beep beep beep. Where are the aliens? 
And this one is all sort. Of, I need it. I'm just hoping there's an extra one of these, man. That's what I want. An extra one of those, dude. Daddy needs an extra one of those. All right. Where is it? Any one of these? You know what part that you don't realize is super like necessary? These single dot studs with the open hole on them. Those things are super, super powerfully important. I've realized. I kind of need to like dig through my stash to find just those. They do. They do come. These ones are these ones with the nipples on them are pretty handy dandy too. Those. Those things. Those things are heaps, heaps rad. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, now we're getting over here. Uh -huh. All right. Underneath time. Oh, look at this. It looks like some sort of space arm, man. A space grabbing arm hmm. oh, this this looks precarious at best let's see where does this go Oh. oh, it clicks in right there. Oh, it's tricky to get my fat little sausage fingers in there. All right, so that's some sort of like doohickey, some arm. Oh, it's going to get a go grab that thing. Go grab it. Do do it space. What is what are all these gizmos? All right, here we go. We got the looks like we got the final details of the uh, the of the main body there. Now we're on to the I'm gonna build two of these. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's got a ball joint in there. Ball joint. It's gonna do some sort of Swivel, maybe. All right. And then we have two of these, two of these. Oh, I like these. It's going to be, where are we at? Where are, oh, oh, okay. And then we go, bam. I'm kind of freestyling this part right here. All right, there it is. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, this is what the uh, the little little fence, the garden fences are for. Look at this. Look at how. Oh, isn't that cute? Amazing. We're going to finish this bad boy up tonight. Then I got to find a place to put it. We're eventually going to set up some sort of alternate universe for all this stuff. So I just got to like get the time, get the time. I have the time. I got to get undistracted. I need to get focused, man. I got to pull it all together and get focused, yo. Focused, yo. That's what I need to do. Hmm. That's interesting how they want you to do that. Okay. All right. Oh, okay. 
making it extra strong. All right. All right, look at that. Look at that. I don't know what that is, but that's pretty spacey. It's got a space vibe. Focus, yo. Near me, my stepdad's friend owns a large museum, so I can go in and build models for him, and it's located near right Bridgeport, Ohio. Oh, that's super cool, man. That sounds like a pretty dreamy reality. You got a cool stepdad. My stepdad's friend owns a large museum, so I can go in and build models for him. That's it. That's winning that's a winning that sounds cool man all right what do we got here that sounds fun man modeling's rad i was I've been actually like checking out some like, you know, when Al gets a little older, it's going to be time to move to like models, like model models. But I'm stoked. We can just hang out in Legoland for the next couple of years. I'll be super stoked at that. I just want a nice, calm world to just do Legos in. I don't want any drama, man. I just want a drama free, drama free Lego building universe. We really need the people of Lego to get behind like a drama free Lego universe. Just too much drama right now, man. It's just keeping me distracted from clicking bricks. Clicking bricks, man. Clicking bricks to me is like reading books. You can only really do it when you're relaxed. All right, and then these go underneath. Okay, boom, click. That was a good click. That's a click. Feel that bottom bottom clicking. Bam. Oh, oh, but I didn't click that when it fell off. You got to click it better. Boom. Hmm. All right, so these are done. We'll put these in the done pile. Dunsky. Oh, we're getting pretty low on parts. It's we're coming to the finish line. Okay, and then boom. Boom. I wonder what this is gonna be. Oh, I gotta do this a bunch of times. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna step up to the plate and do 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 full, full mass constructions at five. Get it done. Boom, boom. Here we go. There we go. Swing, click it, click it, and tick it. And then you go. All right. I don't know what this is, but it is what it is. It's happening. It's coming together. I'm super pumped. Yep. All right, what do we got here? Where do these go? Oh, and then it gets a bar across, a four-pack across the top. Click that in. Click that in. And this looks like it clicks. Oh, wait. I almost jumped ahead, people. I almost jumped ahead, and then it clicks in. Clicks in. All right, I see what all the clicking's about. Damn, that's pretty rad. That multiple techniques. You got them going this way, going that way, holding it all together, man. The technic bricks are the cat's meow. All right. I don't know why they don't have you put this part on. Wait, am I missing a... I missed a part, dude. I wasn't paying attention. 
skip to part, fail, skipping, skipping ahead. I wasn't focused. I wasn't in the zone, man. I don't know why they don't have you put these parts on right now. Why would you put them on after you click this whole thing together? I don't quite get that. I'm going to do that now. Seems like a better program. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. One part I need. One part I'm hoping there's an extra I seem to be short of. Huh. Missing a part, man. I'm missing a part, y'all. Uh, I, I did a drop on the floor. It must have dropped on the floor. Oh, did it drop on the floor? Down on my knees. Where is it? Oh, is it in the bag? Is it in the bag? I thought I felt something slide off the table. So there it is. It's on the floor. I found it. Score. We're back in the game, people. Never been shorted by a Lego set yet. All right. So this looks like Luggage the Legend pulling in. I like how most of your community is small, but mostly loyal and will click on your videos often i looked up to how to get a quarantine bulk up because my brother was going to shave his head and your ah uh, bulk up maintenance video popped up with the with your child when he was just a toddler yeah yeah no i, I got a, my my the, the the team here is real loyal man We've been doing this. Uh, well, welcome to the channels. I'm stoked you're here. Yeah, we've been doing this YouTube dance for going on 10 years now. 10 years on the uh, on the, the network. We're, we're not looking for numbers, dude. It's... Uh, it's not quantity, it's quality, man. I I really have the way have a I way rather have a smaller viewing base and a loyal viewing base than an ah uh, than a than a big one. Uh, they should they should have had me do this earlier. All right, I got it. I'm due for another bowl cut though. Well, I guess we're technically still in quarantine, but. I kind of promised to do it. I never got around to it. All right, here we go. We got these like these solar sails or whatever these are. I don't know what they're supposed to be. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's all about loyalty at this stage of the game. We don't need no stinking trolls, man. We don't need any. St so did your did your uh, did your brother shave his head? Oh, uh, you've been here through the quarantine. Well, I'm stoked you're here, man. Ex and and an Ohio person to top it off, dude. The heart of it all, man. Love the Ohio the Ohio community. Got a bunch of friends from Ohio. Some of my some of my oldest friends are are from Ohio. Uh oh, where does this connect? Right. Big big fan of the uh, the heart of it all. Okay, ah, oh, that's cool. These rotate. That's pretty neat. Da, da, da. A lot of rotating parts here. All right, then we're I guess we're number back six. We're just finishing this bad boy up. Let's see. Where do these where do these where do the sales go on? Mm, they just click in, click in side angle. Okay, then we're that's that's it. That's all she wrote. All right, let's do it. 
Okay. Oh, I got it. They're all, they all articulate. The whole thing articulates. Okay. Let's do it like that. All right. Let's get it, let's get it all fired up here. Space station. I remember Jang saying he didn't like something about the way these sails were built. They seem pretty proper to me. I forgot why Jang was saying he didn't didn't like them, but I'm cool with them. Jang's Jang's pretty solid I, as far as the and and I like uh, I like the kid out of Florida. He's good too. Those are pretty much my two Lego channels I follow. The kid out of Florida's got a couple. I like his like. Uh, all right, there we go. There it is, the International Space Station. Check it out. All right, let's 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 read the comments here. What do we got going on? Where are the bowl cuts? What's up, Rocket Man 88 I'm awake and got to catch a late stream. Yeah, we're doing – these are the relaxing late stream, no rants. Yeah, shaved his head all the way off, but it's also kind of funny as my stepdad works at Colgate Palmolive near St. Claire, Clairsville. And the spaceship scaled to size with the space station. Is the, is the spaceship scale? It looks great. He's an electrician. My brother's an electrician's apprentice. You don't need to, you don't want to have a bunch of hair if you're, I, I think this seems pretty scaled. I, I don't know, man. Maybe it's not. Is that scaled? It seems scaled. To me, I mean, I don't know. Is it? Is it scaled? I'm gonna turn these. Look at, oh yeah, we're getting, we're getting maximum solar right there. Oh, articulating. Oh, we're getting, uh, zooming them all in. This thing's pretty badass, dude. I actually have to. Seems about right, right? That seems like the right scale. Like if you had to like, I don't know where the space shuttle would hook up, like right there or something. Wing. Yeah, it seems about right. Where would the space shuttle hook up? Seems like that's the spot, man. So I am I like the little space shuttle build. I thought the space shuttle build was pretty cool how they did that. It seems fairly like accurate to scale. Like once again, the uh, even with the black trim on the thing, once again Lego blows my mind with their ability to build stuff. So here it is. Here's the International Space Station, and it goes free. Shh. We're we're floating in a tin can, far above the world. Planet Earth is blue. And there's nothing I can do. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Tell my wife I love her very much. She knows. This is Major Tom, the ground control. Circuit's dead. There's something wrong. And then there's 99 loof balloons, dude. I forget how that one goes, dude. But yeah. So there you got the backside, the whole thing. It's pretty. This is definitely one of those ones, like, I don't, there's not even a good, I guess it's it's a space station. It just floats. It doesn't really fly. Oh, no, dude, things are falling off. It doesn't really fly, does it? Oh, no. Ah, where's that part? Ah. Where does that go? Uh-oh. I think that goes. Where does that go? Hmm. This one doesn't seem very kid friendly if you're if you're asking me. Do you want my opinion about whether you want the, the children playing with this one? I'm gonna go no. I'm gonna go no. I'm gonna pass on that. Where does this go? This came off, and I don't know where it goes. It's all the stuff in the front. 
Oh, there it is. Where does this go? There's the piece that I opened it to the right page. It connects right here in the back. In the back. In the back, yo. All right. So, and then we got this the shuttle. Where would we land? I don't know, dude. Oh, we're just gonna land in the rack. So we're kind of fired up on that. This is it. This was a cool build. I'm, I'm gonna. I, I once again. It's a, it's just a cool build. Have a nice night, Jake. Sweet. So I'm gonna. I like this build. I think it's a little fragile. It's definitely a display model. It's not very doesn't seem very play friendly it's kind of big so i don't even know where to put it uh, you know i'm baffled on that but let me give you a preview of what's what's coming dude on the uh on the late night mellow builds on the late night mellow builds i did i did I did pick this up from the uh, that Lego store with your with the kind donations that you do send to this channel. Links down below if you do want to help us purchase some Lego sets. I did get the Kylo Ren's command shuttle. I get this from an independent Lego store, not not a corporate franchise. So I am supporting a local business. You got an old seventy year old black dude named John runs the place. He's super cool, dude. I don't know why I need to bring up the color of his skin, but whatever. I guess it's important nowadays, man. But uh, yeah, so I got this thing. This is the, the older one. So this this thing's uh, right there. And then then I got this. I got this from one of those Lego stores, used ones, man. Which one should I do next? Should I do Kylo Ren shuttle or should I do Pose X-Wing? Yeah, I know, EX35512. It is an identifiable feature. He's a cool old guy, dude. He's classic, John. I like John, man. So should I do this one next or Star Wars? Well, they got everybody second guessing everything nowadays, anyhow. That, that's that's why. Which one should I do next? I'm gonna leave it up to you. It's either this one or the, or the opening in the box. Which one should I do? Pose shuttle. I'm I'm on Poe's shuttle just because it's like loose in a bag, and um, that's my Poe's shuttle. It is. All right, we'll do Poe's shuttle next. We'll do Poe's shuttle next. Oh yeah, dude. Yeah, this one's nice. This is gonna make a nice look here. We'll, we'll get it on the display right now. We'll, we'll we'll dial it in on the display. Set up. I don't know what any of this stuff is anymore. This is all owls mess back here. These are owls, dinosaurs, Jurassic Park. All right, here we go. We're going in for the for the display. Whoa, whoa! It's top heavy.
There we go. Boom. Yeah, I think that's the spot. It can keep an it can keep an eye on the uh, it can keep an eye on the uh, on the thing. Except you can't see it now; it's just hidden behind me. How can I stay so fit? Do you work? How can you stay so? Do you work out or have a certain diet? I just stay active, man. I skateboard. I surf. I mountain bike. I play with my son as much as humanly possible. And uh, I try to stay away from high fructose corn syrup. And I don't drink soda. I don't drink soda pop. The one thing I do is I drink my tonic water with stevia. I try to stay away from... Uh, I'll make some masks, dude. Dude, little guy. Nonsense. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's how I stay fit, man. I just stay moving, dude. Just stay in motion. I try to stay off the couch. Island Ryland, what's going on? What's happening, Island Ryland? Stoked to see you. But that's pretty much it. Just active lifestyle. I did. I did get a, as Owl calls it a China belly. I did get a sort of a China belly from my. I don't know. That's what he called. I put on a, a couple pounds for, what, during the uh, the coof. He called it my China belly. Thought that was pretty clever, dude. You know, uh, we just finished up building the International Space Station, Island Island, like where we're like we're wrapping it up, dude. I've had an eye out for the stevia brand, but I can't seem to find the tonic one. It's if you go to the if you go to the stevia website, you can order their all their stuff. They also have very tasty spicy ginger ale. It's pretty good. I'm a big fan of the stevia, this the zevia, zevia, but it's a it's a different because the the little cans are mixers, mixers. They also have like a lemon one too. My wife drinks the uh, we get the the soda. We like the cream soda. It's pretty good too. I, I'm a big fan of the zevia. I think makes an excellent product. I, I have to say for a. For no sugar, no artificial sweeteners, non-GMO, naturally flavored. And this one contains actual quinine, dude. I've had a bad metabolism and I need to get it checked out. I've just been getting bigger. Gut health, dude. I'll tell you what, dude. It's, it's all probiotics, man. The number one thing that, that people don't take care of is their gut, their gut flora. It'd be My advice is... Bad metabolism is usually due to your gut flora has been killed out and you have candida. Most people have candida and they don't even know it, dude. If you have any sort of fungus under your nails, that's probably candida. And it, if you have a bad metabolism, it's usually because of like hydrogenated oils and dude, sugar is the worst, man. Sugar causes the fungus in your, in your intestinal tract. And then most of the other stuff that you take kills it, dude. Gut health, dude. Eat, eat, start eating a bunch of like uh, pickled foods. Pickled foods are really good for your gut health, like sauerkraut, pickled beets. Pickled beets are really good for you. Anything pickled is super good. Kimchi. Kimchi is a real winner for getting your uh, metabolism going. Just probiotics dude you can get that good belly drink kombucha kimchi dude there's this uh there's this drink you can get called a uh, good belly and it's super good you can get like different flavors and it's a probiotic it's not like kefir kefir is another good probiotic but you know kefir sort of think this is like a juice that's fully probiotics i get it Metabolism was genetic. Still, I don't know, man. You know, you can't trust the doctors anymore, dude. You gotta, you gotta go. Almost go see one of those uh, gut flora people. I need to take the pills. So I need to take the pills. I get it. I get it, man. I get it. But check it. Look into it, dude. 
gut health, super, super important. Could solve your need for pills. I have, but I'm no doctor, dude. I'm just, I'm just some dude with a Lego set clicking bricks. <laughs> Oh, these are the spare parts. You get a spare space, man. You can take whatever, but you can also eat real food. Yes, Rocket Mon, you said it. Rocket Mon, you said the truth there. Yeah, it doesn't hurt to eat real food. It doesn't hurt to cut down on the on the anything. Anything. Look, we live in a. I'm gonna go do a little bit of a food food thing right now. We live in a time in this in this era where anything like 10 years ago, 10 years ago, dude, like if you wanted to eat like potato chips, you had to eat basically garbage. You can pretty much get organic, clean, any kind of snack food you want now. If, if snack food's your jam, dude, like, you know what I mean? I get these organic jalapeno chips dude white corn it's all organic all non-gmo you read the no high fructose corn syrup no msg dude taste and once you once you get you the, the stuff tastes better dude I'm, I'm just my my take on it all dude is whatever you eat you can get a healthy alternative to it like any pretty much anything if it comes if you're in there that like you look we all shop at the supermarket dude it's not like it was 50 years ago, dude, where you're going to the butcher and you're getting, you know, we eat what we eat, dude. I'm just saying anything you eat nowadays, you can get a, a healthy, uh, the Amish got it going on, dude. Yeah, yeah, the chips are good, man. I'm just saying, dude, my wife gets these coconut chips made out of coconut flour or something, dude, because she's a food loon. She takes it a little bit too far, but she gets these coconut flour chips. They're so good. The salt and vinegar ones are phenomenal. I mean, it's a, the texture is a little different. Dude, you can get my, I feed owl these little, they're like, they're, uh, get, you know, Cheez-Its, you know, Cheez-Its. You can basically get Cheez-Its that are made out of cauliflower non-gmo organic cauliflower they're chips made out of cauliflower dude that's how crazy it is you can get basically all that garbage snack food made out of cauliflower now no hydrogenated oils no palm oils nothing all organic all non-gmo i mean when you say organic of course it's not gmo but you got to be careful with that one natural does not mean it's healthy you got to make sure it says organic because if you get non-GMO, that doesn't mean it's organic. You got to get organic, and then it's non-GMO by its very. I, I keto's keto's an interesting thing, but you can't deviate. My wife was keto for years, dude. It's it's definitely a fat burning metabolism thing, dude. But you can't deviate. You can't not be keto, or you're not keto. Like you got to be keto, keto, keto or you're not keto at all. It's, it's, it's a all or nothing pursuit, which eh, doesn't seem very fun to me, dude. I, the cauliflower pit, the cauliflower pizza too. It's a colonial crop, but you know, a colonial crop, dude. Right. Right. I forgot. Cauliflower is, is food of the patriarchy, dude. That's right, dude. Look, man, you can get you can get you can get a pizza made out of the uh, the yuca. You get a yuca pizza, dude. <laughs> Don't eat food made out of vegetables that that oppress people, man. <laughs> eat eat non-oppressing vegetable products in your in your snack foods dude if you're gonna snack don't don't eat patriarchy foods you use non-patriarchy snack foods in your organic snacks <laughs> it's really gotten that stupid hasn't it it's so dumb now dude
<laughs> Nothing safe, dude. Uh, I need to almost go to the other podcast because I feel like talking some smack, dude. If you cheat, you lose. I'd rather take a minute, 10, 10 minute commute to the Planet Fitness. Yeah, I'm with you on that, dude. Keto is not for me, dude. Oh man, main channel live stream, dude. I can't. I went. I went. I went hard today, I, Island. <laughs> I. I. The hottest is I think I named the, ch the video on my other channel like maintaining balance or something. I think I went fully off the deep end, dude. Uh, uh, you know someone's mad, dude. I made. I guaranteed made somebody mad. People are mad. Like, dude, what do you mean? What do you mean? You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna just, yeah. What are you gonna do, dude? Look, as as I was telling my friend the other day, I like pineapple pizza. Am I wrong? No, you're right. <laughs> you're one hundred percent right to like that pineapple pizza, dude. <laughs> dude, but you know what my favorite is? Is pineapple pizza with jalapenos, dude. Oh, dude. Mm. But as I was talking to my buddy the other day, if you're not pissing people off, you're not you're not doing it right in 2020. Someone has to leave with their with their panties in a bunch, dude. You know what I mean? That's what the Lego channel's for. You can't. <laughs> I've sort of deviated, dude. But but the Lego the spicy sweet combo, dude. Yeah, dude. Best of both worlds, man. Find the balance. Finding the balance. Yeah, dude. Uh, I know, dude. But they, no one wants the facts anyway. They just want their echo chamber. Echo, 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 echo. People can't handle the truth, man. You know, Tom Cruise said it best. You can't handle the truth. But hey, that's why we're on the Lego channel, dude. We don't need to talk. There's no, there's no truth that needs to be talked on this channel. It's just Legos and a little bit of a little bit of cauliflower pizza. <laughs> All right, hey everyone, we're gonna come back. We're gonna do pose, pose X wing here on the next live stream night, nighttime mellow out with the Legos. And uh, hey, keep on building a better brick ship Earth, one brick at a time. This is Mini Figure Illusion <laughs> signing off. <laughs>